everyone. Welcome to another game of the week here on the PBF official channel. Uh, my name is Mike Neely. With me, as always, Adam Neal. And we're back. Here we are. Uh, today, we have, <laughs> we have a battle everybody wants to see. A broken man. Silver Dial on the left versus Soren27 on the right, a.k.a. Wieners. V2. Uh, yeah, new with new owner Drew under Adam. New ownership, under yeah. new management. Uh, Adam, how do you think Silver Dial is gonna counter the uh, the Zoroark illusion? Uh, I don't know. It'll be interesting. It, it'll it'll all play off of what he comes out as. And it's it. He I think. he built a great team because unless all, he scouted and knows all the other five guys around Zoroark, he would not attack the same way. Right. So he. Uh, and the original, you have to credit the original owner for drafting mm -hmm. such a team. You really do. Uh, may may God, uh, or whatever. Have mercy. Pokemon related deity. May, Arceus. Uh, Arceus. Have mercy. Have on mercy on his soul. soul. Uh, so, <laughs> let's get this underway to see how Silver Dial counters that strategy. Uh, leading off with a big fake out from Mega um, Metacham. A big fake out. That's uh, a lot. Smart switch into the Sigilyph, quad quad uh, resistant to fit, to fighting. Awful lot of switching. This yeah. is a lot of switching. And uh, let's slow down the speed here. Isn't real that, quick. Uh, yeah. Playing off of Mega Blastoise's ability with the Dark Pulse. Uh, I forget his ability. Mega Launcher. That's right. It. Yeah. Strengthening pulse moves. Very uh, strange that it doesn't work for Hydro Pump, but I think everybody has already thought that to themselves anyway. <laughs> It is, you would think, it, it, considering he has cannons in his body. Yeah. You would think that there'd be a little boost there. Uh, but uh, Togekiss, uh, using a smart uh, stall strategy here, mm -hmm. getting a Thunder Wave and then a Serene Grace flinch percentage boost. Uh, and we're going to have to imagine another switch here again. You don't want to yeah, see. Yeah, you can't have a Zapdos out against her. You can't have a, right, you can't have a. Zapdos facing your Togekiss. Right. So we see the switch out here. Uh, S. Cavalier. S. Cavalier. Interesting. Ooh. Interesting, because he will... Lucky Paralyze. Yeah. It, it, will he not take uh, flying damage if he uses... Doesn't matter. Never mind. Nope. Because uh, isn't this clear? Uh, he's a steel bug, yeah? Yep. Hmm. Interesting when uh, you would have to guess that Zapdos has Heat Wave. Zapdos usually has Overheat, or... Heat waved something to that effect. Silverdale just straight up told him he's hacking. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, I've been hacked to death a lot in this tournament. Well, take it. Well, prepare for some more. S Silverdial admitting to hacks. Uh, we see that this game is this in... This is going upstairs. I don't like this one th bit. This game is in the Uber tier because, uh, for some reason, um, one can only guess that someone on either team is running Swagger, uh, which has newly been uh... banned by Showdown, and uh, the villainous swagger. a quick guess uh, says that it's probably on Silverdial's Lipard. Yeah. Which is which is probably the hex that he's referring to. An interesting Will-O-Wisp. Was that, a, that was a change. In that the, was a change, yeah. I was going to say, that was oh, a it was U-turn. -turn. Yeah. I missed it. Yeah. We were talking about hacks. hacks. Now, Adam, do you agree with the uh, banning of uh, swagger as we see Gore guys go down? Fuck yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. No, I do. Um, I think that that strategy, although ingenious, is uh, a lot to handle, the, <laughs> especially uh, if you're a guy like me. The Thunder Wave Swagger foul play. Yeah, of course. Well, like I'm trying to have a life here. <laughs> I'm not trying to break the Swagger strategy. <laughs> As we see, Togekiss doing a good job of just being a tank. As he does. up. Is it a he? It is a he. It is a male. Yeah. yeah. You can tell by the giant dick. Look at it. Look at its, its little... <laughs> I believe that's a tail, Adam. I wish get we your, had a laser get your, pointer. Get your hand off the mouse, Adam. <laughs> there's, there's no way we can tell. <laughs> it seems to be a giant Togekiss penis. A very even battle so far, as both both oh. teams are down two. A smart stone edge. Strong, gotta think. strong stone edge. Ooh, but that Doesn't crit. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. That crit. Gotta be followed by a... Uh, a roost, unless you got a very yeah. speedy Cause you figure, electric move to use. Ditto. Yep. Aegislash. Definitely going to see a roost here. At a t no! Wow. 
didn't know that he had that a flamethrower. cost him his life. Nope. Sword stance? In the long run, though, maybe. You'd have to think Aegislash stays in defensive mode another turn here, Adam. Yeah, yeah, I would imagine. Knowing that that flamethrower's coming. Yeah. Are we gonna see another sword stance? Yep. There it is. Now, interesting. the Very Shadow interesting. Sneak should kill it after two sword stances, I would imagine. Yeah, I, I would as well. Um, there and it, it does. Is. There it is. Now, it's Adam, like... do you send Zoroark out here disguised as something else? I probably do. He's seen everything else. That's true. You figure he's, he's seen everything else on your team. Got to show him. No! Not hiding the Zoroark. Interesting Very strategy. Very upfront. Very up He's saying, "Beat me! I, I will! Named I will it. take on your best game! I don't need tricks." I do. I, do. I should run a swagger Pokemon. Good job. Oh, <sighs> strong Dark God. Pulse. What's his alter? What's his other ability? Uh, do we know offhand? I don't think he has one. I should look that up. We should look a lot after. Of we should up. look things up before the game. No, we would have to. Ooh, no Focus Blast on Zorark apparently. Hmm. Switching into Siglyph. Probably a smart play here. It wouldn't get hurt by foul play too much. Yeah. Uh, can't get... It's uh, it's already burned, so it can't get thunder waved. But it can get swaggered. Here it is. And now it's confused. And it... Ooh, that confusion's gonna hurt. Uh, I would imagine there's a switch here. I hate to be biased, but I would like to see the swagger strategy fall. I hate to be biased. Uh, and... Smart Roost by Siglyph. Good call. Uh, the two t the two times attack really won't help him, but... I'd like to see Wieners be strong enough to break their swagger. We can only hope. Uh, and here we see Metacham. He'll gladly take the two times attack. Doesn't... Oh! Not quite yet. And there's hmm. the Zoroark. Oh! Oh! Well, that was... Wow. You thought you thought I he thought wasn't I... gonna pull out the tricks, and then he pulls out the I tricks. I thought a thing, <laughs> and the thing I thought was wrong. It's like when the when the when the football team runs a play action fake, and it it fools the cameraman. Uh, I'm sorry, I won't bring sports into this anymore. Uh, You're already. Adam's giving me a dirty look. Oh no, I looked straight down. I'm still dying for my Ritas. <laughs> and here we see. My innards are curdling right now. Uh, what do you what shouldn't. do you think Zorak's gonna do here, Adam? Do you think it's well, not much at the moment. <laughs> uh, Adam, do you think the swagger's gonna get? Do you think the swagger strategy is gonna get broken? God, I hope so, but I, I it doesn't look too good right here. <sighs> Death by confusion. Got... You oh, hate to see no, that. Oh no! Come on. And now. By God. Uh, I would have to expect a fake out from Mega Metacham here just to try to break that yeah. sub. Do you think that's going to break that sub, though? Yep. Yep. Now we're going to see... Thun Ooh! Bypassing the paralyzing. Hmm. Going straight for the swagger. I don't know about that move. You would have uh, got I the... I guess whatever order. I don't know. I... I, I well... Ooh. No, I wouldn't guess that. And he gets off the oh, bullet wow. punch. A punishing bullet punch at that. Interesting. Two priority moves. He could get moves. off another one. Two priority moves on Mega Metacham. He has uh, fake out and bullet punch. See if he can get off another one. Tries to go for the 24% substitute. Oh. Uh, that will not work. Uh, the, the battle rages on. Battle rages on. As they on. say in uh, the original Pokemon Stadium, I think. Yes, you are correct. <sighs> Ooh. Strong Man. foul play out of Lipard. Man. And now it's up to Siglyph against Lipard That's and not my Ditto. Dad. This is a Siglyph. <laughs> <laughs> Adam, do you think Siglyph's cosmic power strategy will be able to to overcome? I have no idea. I I really Ooh, will burns okay. the life hard. Okay, that was a good move. Good that move. That was a really good move. Now it just has to hope it doesn't uh, get confused too often. But yeah, that burn is gonna mess up uh, oh, life hard substitute strategy. It is. It won't have enough. Nice roost by Siglyph. I think Siglyph. he's going to do it. I think he's going to do it. I don't want to say it too soon, but... Cutting through the confusion. I think the, the burn might be enough to wean him to death. Resisting the foul play. Ooh, that hurt itself in confusion that time. That's that's not nice. Uh, yeah, I, I'm... But then the question becomes, Adam, if it can outlast Lipard, can it outlast... 
Oh, an admit. My part, Mrs. Swagger. Wow. Mrs. Immediate Swagger. confusion snap. That's. Uh, now, can he beat the choice scarf? Ditto, Adam. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, what you missed was Lipard used foul play, knocked down Birdie South a little bit. Uh, we were talking about the possibility of uh, Siglif versus Choice Scarf Siglif once Ditto comes in. Uh, I don't know what could go on here. I don't. I really don't know. Uh, You'd have to imagine that Choice Scarf has a strong yeah, advantage. Yeah, you it, would have to imagine. It could just come down to predicting a, a, a stored power correctly. Yeah. But the. Uh, He's gonna be here. Locked. We see here. We see Siglif starting the cosmic power, uh, trying to just get the burn away on Lipard. He's gonna be choice though, so he's gonna be. That's true. Choice scarf Siglif he's, he's is not what you want. Very good point, Adam. Uh, he's gonna have to use stored power, and I believe Soren is gonna pull through here. I think so too. I think Wieners pull out with a victory. Uh, let's see. As the little goo ball ditto comes... Ooh, forgot about that. Oh, he picks up all... Picks of... I up... didn't know that. I learned a thing today. Now it's now you have to expect a roost here. It's a yeah. good, smart roost. And he's just going to be locked into stored power. Now, forever. the interesting thing here is he only gets five stored powers. And then the struggle so... begins. As, as, uh, as white girls across America say, this is the struggle. Now, Adam, when do you start using your stored powers if you're uh, if you're wieners? Do you just oh, I wait. wait. I wait until he's struggling. Uh, Soren asking Silverdial if his ditto is choice scarfed, wondering if Silverdial <laughs> did something completely oh, different yeah. than every other ditto. Silverdial acknowledging that he only gets the five PP, and that his death is imminent. Yeah, I, I think Soren's got this one. I, I he's doing he's playing it. I don't want to say it this way, but it's exactly how I would have done it in this situation. <laughs> I, you know, it's just the way that makes sense. He's choice. You take as much as you can, and and uh, have him kill himself. You in know? in some in a uh, poetic gesture, which I'm sure you'll appreciate, Lipard Swagger is going to help in Silver Dial's undoing, because that two times attack is just going to give Stored Power a little extra boost. We saw the Swagger break. We saw the Swagger break. It was nice. I really enjoyed it. I got off. Everything is right with the world left. Uh, you can ban it, but you can't stop it. Ditto dies by struggle. Wieners wins. Siglif. Struggle, pr uh, struggle proof. Swagger proof. Scarf proof. And again, we just Darn. we just missed the 50 turn mark, Adam. We'll never make it. I worry sometimes. I, you, I don't think we want to make it. Because I once had to score a battle that went 72 turns... And it was terrible. Yeah, I wouldn't want that. Did we do that? Uh, no. That wasn't. Us. I that would was... not. I would not put that hell on any other I'm member. Put of that the evil on me, Ricky Bobby. Uh, so Adam, That's your thoughts. Your thoughts of the new look wieners. The new look wieners were efficient. Um, something to be said for a team that, that beats through the uh, newly banned strategy. I liked Toga Kiss a lot. Uh, I thought Zoroark played well, especially with the uh, Metacham fake. Uh, I thought the I could I can't say much about Escavalier. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? No one can. <laughs> he couldn't say much for himself. No. Uh, Gorgais I also could not say much for, except for that he tempted uh, he tempted Mind Challenge with that one missed high jump kick. Right. Which was pretty nice. Took down a lot of damage. Yeah, but other than that, I thought uh, new look wieners were pretty good. All right. Well, we'll be back hopefully earlier next week. With more Battles of the Week right here on the PBF Official Channel, your home of all Battles of the Week and podcasts. Uh, check out the brand new website that just debuted today, April 17th. Uh, Seth Graham did a great job on it. Um, you can see all of the documents there. Uh, pretty soon we'll be able to post videos straight to there. Uh, it's, a, it's a new generation of the PBF, and we're not even done with Season 1 yet. So uh, It's an exciting time to be alive. Sure as is. they say in 1908. Uh, so Adam, any any thoughts to close to close this week? I think I'd really like to see someone use a thick club Marowak. He's on the waiver wire, folks. First person to do it, I'll draw them with crayons. <laughs> what? How can you turn down that over, for folks? Uh, I will be trying to shift my team around to possibly steal Marowak from the waiver wire. 
Uh, until then, for Adam Neal, I'm Mike Mealy. We'll see you next week.